My name is Dr. Amir. It is very important to inform any doctor you visit about the list of all your medications, especially if you are taking several ones. So today's video is about this important and possible dangerous outcome when mixing too many medications together, which is called drug interactions. Drug interactions occur when two or more drugs interact with each other, leading to changes in their effects on the body. Sometimes they can have serious consequences, especially in the elderly. These interactions can occur between prescription medications and even over-the-counter medications. This is the story of one of my patients. He went to a clinic for a bronchitis and was given an antibiotic. Unfortunately, the doctor did not know that he was taking a cholesterol medication, which had interacted with the antibiotics and caused a condition called rhabdomyolysis, which is a muscle breakdown. This is a very dangerous condition, which can lead sometimes to kidney failure. Anyway, he was admitted to the hospital and was given intravenous fluids and until he is improved. Another example of drug interactions is when mixing an antibiotic like erythromycin with an older antihistamine called seldane. Combining both can also cause dangerous heart rhythm. Another situation is when you are sick with the flu. So if you take an allergy medicine called clarinase with another cold and flu medication or another cough syrup containing decongestion like pseudoephedrine or caffeine, this might cause palpitation and sudden rise in your blood pressure, especially if you suffer from high blood pressure. In conclusion, to avoid drug interactions, it is important to disclose all your medications and supplements that you are taking to your doctor. Additionally, don't take any medicine on your own, especially if you're taking another one. Also, it is important to always read the labels and the instruction on the medications packaging and to never exceed the recommended doses.